Hi, I'm Erin Hardy. I'm a freshman at Mercy High School. Snap, crackle, pop! And this is a thank you note to my mental illness, whoever you are this time. Thank you, truly thank you. Because of you, I celebrate my victories. You see, my victories are mountaintops compared to my valleys, my ocean floors of self-deprecation and despair, filled with algae and crusted shipwrecks and dead bodies. One for every single time I have been stuck down there, every single morning, <laughs> afternoon, you have shackled me to my bed and threw my bed, my safe space, into these nuclear dump site level polluted waters. Then there is not one phrase to describe the feeling of reaching Everest after being in the valley below for weeks. I often experience emotional altitude sickness. There's rarely an ocean level equivalent to content feelings. Did I mention I'm terrified of heights? Because of you, my facial expressions are hazard signs, warning any potential friends of what lies beneath my skin, the trauma, emotional damage, scaring them away from any confrontation of mental illness. A select few especially brave bunch of people have ignored the warnings and proceeded. Because of you, I am resilient, resilient to my urges and my uncontrollable mind, my urges to backhand the idiot that has become my brother, my urges to my urges to kiss my crush when she wraps me in a bear hug. My urges to rip out and shatter all of my medical devices, leaving myself to die. My urges to yell these freaking voices in my head when someone asks me what's wrong. Thank you, truly, not just you, but my friends, those who have dragged me into the shore an immeasurable amount of times. Because of you, I have tried to weed out just about everyone in my life, leaving me with the true friends, the I won't tolerate your way to realistic suicide jokes. What do you need? I'm not going to let you kill yourself today, even if it means me not letting you out of my sight type of friends. Essentially, the people who stick around... Uh, friends who have been through my struggles or are currently fighting the same battles. Essentially, the people who stick around care about me. The only ones left are the people I have grown to value as well, friends who are there to understand when my parents choose not to listen. Because of you, I have learned to be myself, to not worry who will accept me, but over time, I have grown more habitually cautious to those who accept me without a doubt. Heck, I don't even accept myself without a doubt. You have reminded me that I am that no one likes me, so why should I try to be likable? Thank you so much. I'm oh so thankful for the struggles you have blessed me with. Sincerely, you're not so imprisoned prisoner.